streaming now. Should hopefully, yep, there we go. Reload the page. Yeah, there we go. I'm gonna update the old. Oh, oh, that's completely the wrong letter. There we go. And bam. So yeah, we're just gonna get right back on into it. To give you guys a recap of what happened last time. Our boy Steve here uh, met with a, or rather forcibly met with, uh, with his party member uh, Paula and Teddy Bear. Very important to the plot, let me tell you what. Very, very important to the plot. Oh. This right away, okay. Don't usually get these. Ah. Uh, hmm. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera, ready? Say, Fuzzy Pickles. Uh, fuzzy Pickles. <laughs> wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Okay, cool. Now to destroy this bird. Uh, so we do have Paula here, who doesn't have the uh, the best of moves, but that's fine. We'll just have her uh, bash. Or not, and it won't really matter in the end. Oh, hey, Cookie. Cool. Um, okay, let's do a status on everybody. Paula, what level are you? Level 1. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Paula is very weak. Um, yeah. Yeah, let's just head back to town here. And just go through here. Fight this thing? All playing rough, eh? And critical hit it to instantly destroy it. For how much XP? 228. Level 2, yeah. Level 3. Oh, we got PSI Fire Alpha. Ooh, baby. Yeah. Ooh, all the stat ups. <laughs> cool. So now that we've taken out that mole, we'll just head off to the next mole. I think that's a mole, anyways. Pretty sure there's like a another critical hit. Yep, level six. And PSI Shield Alpha, alright. Uh multiple enemies, alright. Mr. Batty and- oh, by the way, we have Mr. Batty and Mole playing rough, yeah. Let's just go for PSI Games Alpha, and as for you... Uh... I think it's just PSI Fire the front row, I guess, I don't know. Hmm. And hit him with the Alpha. PSI Fire Alpha. Taking them out. Hit the mole playing rough, and then she'll just beat up the. Oh no! They took out the most important party member! Uh, the teddy bear. Don't take him out, no. Oh, Paula lived, hooray. Level 7, yeah. Okay, time to activate, uh, just a healing alpha, or life of alpha, rather. <laughs> there we go. 
Maximize the old HP. And now let's fight. Thank goodness it hit Geist. Oh, she just does one damage. Okay. And taking out the mole. And level 8. And PSI Thunder Alpha, yeah. Fighting another mole here. Okay. And taken out. Oh, yeah. Taken out. Do, 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 do. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Oh, um, yeah. Said to the right, right, the store here. Yeah, the store right here. Okay, so let's equip the uh, fry pan. Oh, yeah, right, I need to grab my wallet. Rather, right, some. Just a little bit of money, I suppose. Let's just grab. Eh, that'll do. Okay. Fred Pan, alright, which would you carry this? Uh, that'll be Paula's. Alright. 1121, yes. Uh. Let's go for a. Ribbon. And that'll be Paula's. Defense changed to quarter 24, uh, yes. And let's equip a copper bracelet to Paula as well. Okay. And like that, we have made Paula significantly more durable and useful. Ah, uh, yep. Um, so here we got another mole. That we'll just uh, take out here. And Paula gets in a little bit of damage, yeah. Ooh, for 56 on a critical hit. Not bad, Paula, not bad. And level 9. Yeah. Uh, Paula plays a lot more like a glass cannon with her uh, PSI abilities, but I don't really want to uh, get her uh, too weak anyways. Yeah, really, you know, too low on that for the uh, for the boss and whatnot. Oh, yeah. Because again, I am fairly certain that this is a... My Sanctuary location, I believe. Uh, that is necessary to the plot, so... Oh, yeah. Hey, right, croissant. Uh, cool. It was good to pick those up, I suppose. Oh. And like so, we have bats. I just used fire, I guess. I solidified. Okay, hit him with another. Uh, another fire. Okay. Yeah, again, very, very powerful uh, PSI abilities. Oh, yeah. Now to level 10. Not bad, not bad. Oh, yeah. There's a croissant. Alright. Here we go again. Yeah. Yeah. Um. And there we 
go, taken out by Paula. Yeah. Yeah. Not that many strong enemies here, which is quite good for uh for leveling up uh Paula there. That's a very powerful enemy right there. Hmm. Is everyone's life at 144 out of 187? 54 out of 54. Okay. So, I am forgot to put my wallet back. Well, that's fine. Hold on, I'm gonna make a... I'm gonna pop a save right here. Hold on. Do -do 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 -do. Ah. And like that, we are back to it. Sorry guys for the... Ah, for the delay there. Uh, but yeah, let's fight a bear. And hopefully not die. Thunder Alpha, try that. Nope. Yeah, again, very powerful enemy. Gonna try another PSI Thunder. Oh, hits 142, taking him out instantly. <laughs> and again, Paula, very powerful. Very, very powerful uh, character there, yeah. Yep. Yeah, there are some bears and uh, some moles there we're not going to deal with. Uh, just because they are too strong. But these bats, we will 100% fight. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I don't want to waste my uh, PSI on these guys too much. Um, yeah. PSI fire alpha, everybody. Uh, now we're just gonna beat them up. Take them out. And a critical hit. Not bad, not bad. Making sure that we get all of that EXP. Um, yeah. Another PSI fire. Doing a lot right there. Taking them out. And like that, Paula is now solidified, so that's cool. And level 11. And we got PSI Freeze Beta, not bad, not bad. Uh, let's just, uh... Okay, I'm guessing that uh, the status condition ended then. Um, okay, cool. Gonna fight this mole here. Just gonna beat it up. Oh, thank goodness it hit Geist. And critical hit for the win. Ah, uh, yeah. Now, how much do uh, bread rolls heal? Uh, help. Bread roll and eating your cover about 30 HP. Okay, perfect. He is on Paula. Cool, cool, cool. Back through this way and we have another mole. <laughs> I'm just gonna take him out. Oh, and there we go. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Got another one here. Oh, uh, yeah. And they're just gonna beat up here. Perfect, perfect. Um, yeah. 
Hopefully we can find the- oh, here's the exit right here. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, taking them out. There we go. Yeah, level 12. Yeah, getting all those good stats right there, yeah. Yep. Now back through here. Oh, yeah. Let's go back here. Uh. Activate this. Deposit. Yeah, I had a lot on me. Would have been really bad if I died. <laughs> Yeah. Now I'm just gonna take... That should leave me with 50, yeah, which will pay for one night stay at the inn. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do -do -do. It is not right there, it's just right here in front of the... the formerly blue cow. The blue uh, cow thing wasn't such a great idea after all, huh? Yeah. Um, so yeah. Now just go through here. Greetings, guys. Please forgive my lecture earlier. You're now welcome to stay free of charge. Would like to stay? Okay, yes. No, I'm just kidding. Haha, ha, yeah. Oh, um, man. Yeah. So I guess we just have to now, like, uh... Just go into, uh... Back to the ATM we go. Do do do. Yeah. Back to the ATM we go. Do do do. Yeah. It's not uh not that bad uh music here though. Not that bad music. <laughs> oh yeah. And now we're just going to deposit our 50. I'm just curious, what items do we have? Um... Hmm. I suppose we're good at the moment. I'll probably call after we get through the, uh, the dungeon. I'll probably call up the Escargo Express, probably. Oh, so that they can uh, store items and whatnot. Yeah. Yep. Hell yeah. <laughs> no, that was fairly quick. Uh, yep. Alrighty, now let's fight this mole again. And critical hit. Miss with that. I thank goodness Paula dodged because that would have been very unfortunate. Um, yeah. Oh yeah. Back through here we go. We'll try the other way just because we've been that way and there's bears there and I don't really feel like. Dealing with the bears. Ooh, and that's a critical hit. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, now we just go back this way. Oh, yeah. And let's just take out the mole, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, wait, hold on. We'll just use a, uh... Yeah, we'll throw down a PSI Games Alpha, why not? Oh, there's a lot on Paula, though. Oh, and a critical hit on the bat. Cool, so that's kind of a wasted, uh... Game... It even failed itself, so that's... 
very worthless. Um, yeah, that was just a huge old waste of time. Yeah. Is there anything? There's a like one present and a great charm. All right. What does the Great charm must be equipped on your body. It protects you from paralysis attacks. Also, it adds a bit of speed. All right. Um. So then, yeah, we'll. Uh... Oh, all right. I meant like equipped. Then equipped. All right. Anyways, give. I get or not give. Where's the menu? Equip. There it is. And there we go. Protected from paralysis now. Okay, cool. I'm just going to, before we get in this fight, I'm gonna PSI Alpha Paula. And now we'll fight. Get in the fight. Oh no, I just barely missed. Oh yeah. Now we're just gonna beat them up. Okay. And taken out, and they did not do a single attack. And oh, Ness leveled up to level 24. Yeah. And we got the power of healing Beta. Because <laughs> I already had enough trouble with healing Alpha. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Oh, and we got a first strike, and it's just an instant KO. Ah, not bad, not bad. Um, yeah. Yeah, I do really like the, uh, the sprite they used for the, uh, for both the, uh, the moles and the bear. I do quite, uh, quite like it, yeah. It's very, uh, cute and whatnot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It'll be cool to, uh, see that again, I suppose. Once we, uh... Because uh, this is one of those games where they do uh, recycle the uh, uh, the enemy designs after a while. Okay, strange how like on the instant KO it's just like... Bam, or first strike rather, it's an instant KO, but eh, whatever. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> I have to. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out there for a long time now, maybe none of my business, but don't you think it would be a good idea if you took a break? No, ah, I see. Well, it doesn't make me happy, but I understand your point about the fate of the world being at stake. Click. Beep. Yeah. <laughs> this is my uh, favorite thing here about Earth Earthbound, is that they just go at, like, periodic times of the game, just like, Hey, did you remember to... Save? Yeah. Um, I think we're... Yeah, we got this. Let's go! And we'll have... You just throw out a... A freeze beta, why not? Throw out a freeze beta, try that. And it's just an instant KO for two, with 261 damage. That's, that is very powerful. Very, very powerful character that we have. Let's just find another one. Like, these things do nothing to us. Um, hit him with a PSI freeze. Do 125, yeah. Just beat it up. Oh yeah, we take those bears out real quick. Like, like, yeah. There is a butterfly up there. And I am not one to not accept destiny. Yeah. Plus we could use, uh, plus Paula could get a, a bit more of a, of her, uh, PP pee back. Oh yeah, when we first strike to the bear somehow. Well, let's just bash it, and then 
freeze it. And then does this insta-kill the bear? <laughs> it does. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, anyways. Uh, if we go over here, do these guys want to join in? I thought they did. That was just the, the one, I guess. Alright. So yeah, let's just, uh... PSI Fire Alpha these guys. Which won't do as much as, like, the usual attack, but it, do it does a good amount. Uh, yeah, we'll do, uh, PSI games, and we'll just have... You just bash the bear. Got him with the games, Alpha. Yeah. There we go. Up oh, now, level 14. Not bad, not bad. And we got another mole here. That we probably could have first striked, but... Yeah. Now let's just... Oh. And taking it out. Oh, it's still alive. Well... Certainly dead now. <laughs> Yeah, 228 experience each, yeah! Oh, there's a ton of enemies over there. But there is also a present, so let's just destroy this one unfortunate bat. Alright, cool. Now let's go fight a bear and his two bat friends. Oh, and also collect this butterfly that spawned. Yeah. Oh, well, everyone's getting in, alright. Except for the mole for some reason. Is it worth it? We'll just do a... Let's do an alpha and we'll then have you do a... Uh, just freeze on the... Mighty bear. Okay, do your damage. Freeze alpha. Oh, and it, their body solidified, I guess. Just destroy the bear. Before it could even do a single thing, yeah. I'm so oh, wait, right, mole. I almost forgot about the mole. How could I have forgotten? Yeah. How could I have forgotten to destroy that animal? Yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah. And now we just collect this over here. Ooh, PSI Caramel. Those are very valuable. Especially at this uh, point in the game. Because uh, with those items, those allow us to uh, uh, restore our PP. So those are like crazy rare and useful at this point. I don't quite remember if we can, uh, eventually buy those, they are so rare. Um, oh yeah, cool, this thing. Uh, so this is the boss right here. Okay guys, I'm gonna pop down another save point here. Doo -doo -doo. There we go, and right up to it. Ah, uh, let's go! Boss time! You finally got here. This is the second to your sanctuary location, but it's mine now. Take it from me, if you dare. Oops, sorry. Again, like... I don't want to fight, but eh. Yeah, it's not bad music. Alright, okay, anyways, let's absolutely destroy this mole. PSI Freeze Beta. Oh, it's very resistant to ice, alright. Did stop it from... Oh, I think that... Yeah, good evening, Beatrice Baldwin. Yeah, I think this... Yeah, that's meme music that it's playing, I think. Because I heard, like, one note. Um, that's it with fire. Fire. 
Hang on, I'm gonna try and uh turn things. Oh, Paula died. <laughs> okay, that's unfortunate. All right. Um. Well. PSI Games Beta. I think I might have actually been able to heal Paula, maybe. Let's go for a bash. Oh, and we took it out at 1 HP. And level 25, but at the same time, okay. So guys, I'm gonna hit the the reset button here. Hold on. Uh, da -da -da -da. And we're just gonna rewind the entire fight because Paula died and didn't get the experience. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, so let's take this a lot more seriously. PSI games beta. You're gonna go for a PSI Thunder. My Thunder Alpha deal massive damage. Came out of games beta. Trying to life up Alpha. Again, another games beta. Another PSI Thunder. Missed, unfortunately. Kind of a PSI games beta. Ooh. Hold on. Okay. Yeah! Okay. Whew. Yeah, I had to go quick there, or else we would have lost Geist. Uh. Yeah, so yeah, we'll go for PSI Thunder, hit him with a PSI Games Beta. Taking him out. Oh, I missed. Hit him. It will go for a PSI Freeze, I guess. It's because that seems to be more accurate. Doesn't do that much as the thing. Beat him up. Uh, you'll just do a... Actually, better idea. What do I have again? I have... Paralysis. Um, that's probably useful. And then we'll just do a... PSI Fire, I guess. Yeah, it doesn't do that much, is the thing. Alright, so now let's beat him up. Uh, yeah. Oh, come on. It's good to know they can't heal. Yeah, this is a very powerful move, not gonna lie. Um... Under Alpha? Oh, come on. Okay, Paula, you were completely useless through that entire fight. However, we do get the experience, so that is 100% worth it. PSI Magnet Alpha, though, that's pretty powerful. Um, yeah. Okay, cool. Now, guys, it's time... For the final, or for the second, rather, My Sanctuary Location. Oh, here it is right here, I guess. Yeah, I don't quite remember what they... ...call this one here. Geist briefly had a vision. Of a baby in a red cap. Okay, Soundstone recorded the melody of the Lilliput Steps. Hmm. Alright, cool. So guys, that's the second My Sanctuary location, I guess. Fear me. <laughs> This is a bad idea right here. 
I know we're at full, so... No, it is not. So let's just beat up the bear and one hit him again. Yeah. Yeah, this bear is, uh, or these bears not very strong as it turns out. I'm just kind of one-shotting them. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. And restore our PP. And fight a bear. Feel free to join the fight, Mr. Mole. And we'll just do a PSI Fire Alpha on everybody. Just to deal a lot of damage quickly. Alright, I forgot that was their... Uh, that was the surprise round. I thought that was the actual first turn, but no, it was not. So now I just annihilate all of them. Before they can even act, yeah. Now, Geist levels up there. And now we run off. Here we go, here we go. Do 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 do. Yeah. Don't really feel like fighting them. Don't really feel like fighting you. Again, not really in the mood to fight you, so I'm just gonna walk past you. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. We're gonna cower in fear. <laughs> oh, yeah. What do you have to say? What was the anti-blue place like? Was it scary? Yes. Did you see a huge mole like I've heard lives there? What was the anti-blue place uh, like? Was it scary? You seem to thrive in places like that, yeah. So anyways, let's head back to... To the... Oh, you're right, that's the... Uh, the cave there that leads to uh, where Apollo was being held. Um, so yeah, let's head off to, um... Wait, hold on, what do you have to say? Yeah, what do you have to say? But I don't have a chance to apologize. Okay, cool. But I don't have a chance to apologize, alright, yeah. Um, so yeah, let's head off to... Uh, back to Tucson, I guess. Uh, aka, we have to pass through the Nope Lands again. Oh, hey, it's the, it's the, like, the key resident of the Nope Lands. The Kamikaze Tree. Everyone loves the Kamikaze Tree. <laughs> oh, yeah, Territorial Oak. I hate you with a burning passion. I'll just take out the Mobile Sprout first, and then just hit him with a... Freeze Alpha on the Territorial Oak. And we just destroy that sprout. Everyone just beats up the oak. Okay, and now we mash. Oh, those things knock out Paula real easily. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nope. <laughs> y'all ever want to know why we call it the Nope Lands, it's because of the... of the trees. Oh, yeah. And like that, Spinning Robo was defeated, yeah. Yeah. Nope. Oh, yeah. Uh, there's a lot of trees. Okay. I'll have Ness beat up the little UFO, and then we'll just have Paula beat up the, uh... The spinning robo. Okay, okay. Just beat him up. And there we go. And what's present? Uh, there was a... Meteornium? I have never heard of this item before. Help, Meteornium. It can be sold for a very high price, nothing happens if you use it. Explanation is kind of tough, alright. 
So it's like a, uh, a nugget in Pokemon, I get you. Crazy, is there if, if we hit it with a PSI Fire Alpha? No, it's just the usual thing. Oh, no, 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 Paul, don't die, Paul, don't die. Oh. Oh, that was so close for Paula, though. Uh, life up, Alpha, please. Thank you. Oh, yeah. At least they fixed the bridge. So at least we don't have to worry about that. Um. Yeah. And like that, we just take out all the enemies. Oh, yeah. Taking them out, taking them out. Because we need EXP. Do do do. Ooh, for 111. Ooh. Now that is uh, some damage right there, let me tell you what. <laughs> yeah. Um, I have this. Okay, I might have some something to say here as we recover our PP. Blue, blue. Oops, I won't say it again. I fixed the bridge as a sign of apology. I'm just trying to help, yeah. Your sign of help is very much appreciated, uh, friend. Oh, yeah. Oops, sprouts have come to battle. And like so, we just uh, destroy them. Pretty much with no signs of resistance, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Back through here we go. Uh, more sprouts to take out because experience. <laughs> yeah, how much guys, or how much experience do these guys give again? You'll have to see. I know, I'm pretty sure that it's divided among uh, party members now. Or it might not be, I don't know. I just feel like with bosses they do that maybe? I don't know. Oh yeah. Hm. Not bad time though. Not bad time. Lost all motivation in battle. <laughs> Alright. And we finally hit the, uh, homesick condition? Is, is that what we're experiencing here? I'm guessing it is. Yeah, homesick. Alright. Well, we'll just have to get Ness back to town then. And Butterfly. Yeah. Alrighty, now it's time to go call up uh, Mom in order to get rid of our homesickness. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll probably head over to Paula's in a second, but first let's beat up this hippie! There are so many enemies in the lower left corner. Like, honestly, what even? Like, like let's actually explore down there, because there are like... Is, is this just where they gather? Is, is this just what they do on a daily basis? They just... gather here? Hey, like I've I've never seen this happen before. I I, I like honestly. Yeah, yeah, Ness, feel free to miss home all you want. Yeah. Um. So yeah, let's uh run through here. Do do do. Run through here still. 
Uh, here's the department store. And so now we just go on over here. And, alright. Now we just, the payphone costs one dollar, okay. Yes, let me withdraw something. Thank you. For my one dollar. Hey. Yeah, I know, I already know your mechanics. Anyway, it's time to call mom. Or that's... Okay, so it's dead. I deposited 7069 into your bank account. Ah, oh, thank you, Dad, for the funny number. Taking away what you've spent, you should now have uh, 6,512 in the bank. Well, EXP, get to the next level. Geist, uh, 6532. Apollo, 3052. Anyway, uh, what do you need from me? Nothing really. Good luck. Click PPP. Yeah, no, that was the... Alright, hold on, let me withdraw another... Uh... One dollar. Guys picked up the receiver. Yeah, alright, call mom. Hello, guys, what's wrong? You sound so sad. Are homesick? Well, I knew there would be days like this. Must make you feel better listening to your mom's sweet voice. So, do you feel any better? Well, I'd better get going. I'm in the middle of my ironing. Bye. Click. Beep, beep, beep. Yeah. Guys got over being homesick. Yeah. Still the same, uh... A featureless expression, though. Yeah. And I got hit by a car. <laughs> oh, yeah. So now let's just head back to... Uh, Paula's place real quick. Uh... Oh, butterfly. Oh, we also have to go to Everdreads as well, but that'll... Not take too long. Might as well do, uh... Ever dread first. Well, yes, Paula, before we talk to your parents, let's go and talk to a local crime boss. Oh, yeah. And like so, we just go and oh, there's just a hippie in the woods. First, you must take her to her parents. They're really worried. I also have something to give you, so be sure to come back here. Promise? All right. Okay, then. Apparently going to the known crime boss was not the correct option. <laughs> uh, yeah, as we run back... ...to the place that we need to go. Do-do-do. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. Now we just walk it through the door. Ignore these children, because who cares? Oh, Paula! Guys, thank you so much. You must be the boy who will save the world like in Paula's dream. Paula, I'm sure you'd be a big help to Geist. Uh, I'm, again, my name's Steve. It's not every day a father lets his daughter embark on a journey to save the world. Dad, don't worry about me. Geist and I will be able to take care of ourselves. Again, my name's Steve. Who are you people? Uh, in three of the next town, we'll meet another friend. If three of us can combine our power, no one can beat us. Now wipe your eyes, blow your nose, and smile before we take off. Goodbye, Paula. Don't worry. I won't cry anymore. Goodbye, Paula. Don't worry. I won't cry anymore. Alright. Cool. You like the mom? Yahoo! I knew it. You saved Paula. I don't really understand it, but I know that Paula's miraculous power and your great courage will allow you to stand up to any challenge. Paula, if you must take a trip, be sure to bring this along. It's my very own handmade band-aid. Ooh, that rhymes. I know. I'll call it a hand-aid. Paula got the hand-aid. Did you meet Dad? He's, uh, sorry that he suspected it. Mr. Everdred of Berglund Park, yeah. Speaking of which, let's go and collect his garbage. Or, talk to this guy. Hello, Geist. Hey, my name's Steve. Everdred is, Everdred is looking for you. He's got something for you, yeah. Yeah, there are just some moments where I swear the walking speed just gets, like, really slow. <laughs> or, like, feels really slow, rather. Oh, yeah. And away we go. Yeah. Known crime boss, what do you have to give me? I was going to ask you to be my partner, but I know you'll refuse. It's written all over your face. Again, b blank, expressionless face. <laughs> If you accept it, I was going to give you some money. Actually, I can't keep the money now anyway. Let me give this to you. 
It's ten thousand dollars! Use the money any way you like. You cannot refuse my generosity, just accept it. Now I plan on looking for the evil Money Money statue that, uh, Liar Eggs Adgerate unearthed and on it. I'll see you at another time in another space. Paula got the wad of bills. Okay, I thought I was stuck there for a second. Um, use Paul used the wad of bills, but nothing happened. Okay. Oh, this is for the wad of bills. A bundle of brand new crisp bills, aren't it? Uh, whatever game, I guess we don't get $10,000, but we'll be sure to certainly get more of that by the end of the, end of the game. And away we go. Do do do. Uh, so you might be wondering, what do we do with $1,000 if we can't use it ourselves? We'll talk to this guy. You're for gold today. You must be pretty popular. How about introducing her to my bandmate? He's right there. Rivet, I did not mean to talk to you. Hey, you came with Paula, then you deserve a present, playboy. He's a backstage pass. You can get into our shows with this. Paula got the backstage pass, yeah. Ah, oh, cool, this is uh, two this time around. I believe we got either two or three last time. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius, if I do say so myself. Okay. Get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera, ready, say, Fuzzy Pickles. Uh, fuzzy Pickles, I was a bit late on that, but alright. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Oh, wee. <laughs> oh, yeah, I believe I need to buy a, a ticket from this place, though. I guess I lost my ticket, so now I can't get in. The ticket counter at the department store was even sold out, alright. Hello, please present your ticket. Alright. You wanna see uh, Poochifa, the manager, right through this door, please? Alright. Just let us walk right in. Throwing away five, owe me a lot of money. They'll stay here until they pay me back. They might be here for a hundred years. Let's decide to pay off their debt. <laughs> Let's use the wad of bills. Pardon, you wanna talk about money? But later after the show, even if we're talking big bucks, I've got definite rules about how I handle my money matters, alright. I mean, you sure? Okay. Alrighty then. So maybe just like... Go up to these people and use the money. <laughs> Let's activate the... A lot of bills. Probably use the one of bills, but nothing happened. Okay. Do it, uh... You can get, come with your girlfriend, we'll be waiting. Alright. Wait, do I just use the backstage pass on the, on the, on the guy here? Goods. Backstage pass use. Here you go, hurry. Here's some time to see the Runaway 5 show. Alright, cool. So we get to watch this now as the carpet flashes very brightly. Um... Hey, don't get too close to me, I just farted. <laughs> yeah. No problem there, I guess we just, like, talk to you. The Runaway Five we're going to be a world-famous band someday. Do we go through here? I'm sharing my clothes now, don't come in, alright. Um, do-do-do. Da-da-da. Ah, and I probably should not go back there, um... Hey you kids, how did you get tickets? What are you, the owner's kids or something? Yeah. Came here because it's tough to get in, but I'm kind of disappointed. There are no good looking waitresses, and there is no room for me to show off my latest dance moves, yeah. Oh yeah, this seems plenty of room to me, but whatever. You know, I think it's pretty uh, tacky to entertain our company's business partner by taking him to a Runaway 5 show. Since I'm new to the company, I better just tow it, tow the line, yeah. Oh yeah. Well, well, I got a little kid here talking to me like he's an adult. Yeah. I give you one thing, you got guts, kid. I seem too proud, I mean, they just filled up this little music hall after all, yeah. My boyfriend lost the ticket that I gave him. He's waiting outside the entrance. He's got butterfingers, but he's nice, yeah. 
Hey, hey, don't get to- yeah, I already. Talk to you and you. When I sit close to the stage, sometimes I get sweat or spit on me from the Runaway 5, yeah. Seeing the Runaway 5 on stage is my life, yeah. It's a bounce around, I'm talking to everyone, it's getting annoying. Yeah, I know, there's no one else. Like baseball, yes, I knew it, your cap gave it away. Like baseball, no, ah, I see. No, you didn't look like you could figure out a sophisticated game like baseball anyway, alright. La la la, I just love ragtime, yeah. And fan like you really gets into the, into the Runaway 5's music? Wow, I'm impressed, yeah. Lucky of the Runaway 5 told me I could go backstage, but I don't have a pass. I'm sure security will stop me. Hey, really? You have a pass? I can't believe it. Can you take me with you, please, 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 please? I could pose as your sister. Yes, this rocks. Let's go. Ooh, my heart is pounding. Oh, that's... I guess that's just how we go in. <laughs> Uh, well yeah, in the old days there was lots of dances and actors, acts at this theater, except now we're the only act playing here. You've been gone into debt here, so we're pretty near stuck, you kick kick. Folks of Tucson will enjoy the Runaway 5 show for quite a few years, looks like to me. Shabadoo wop diddly doo da, shabadoo ba 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 I got these debt blues, mum mum mum. If I had $10,000, I could pay off my debts and move to the next town. I wonder if a bus still runs, it may be rusted out. Yeah. That's uh, so about that. Uh, just have uh, $10,000 to try to use your play money here, kid. Oh my gosh, that's not real money, is it? Wow. Well, yeah, no, okay. Yeah, I already talked to him and to use the... Uh, the money on you, see if that does anything. Well, hello, you got cash and some nice stuff to boot. Yuck, 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 yeah. Over the lyrics to most of the Runaway 5 songs. Uh, money, that's what I want, money. That's what is hot money. Yeah, okay. So, now let's just use the item. Wow, $10,000. I can make another song now. 10 G's, 10 G's, that's dollars, baby dollars, yeah, 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 alright. I want some bread, I need the coinage, I want more dough all the time, yeah. So let's just show everybody the money, and then not give it to them. That is exactly what I want, I can't believe that you have that much, yeah. I was excited, I might just sweat myself, my heart is going pitter-patter, yeah, I didn't mean to talk to you. Hey, you got to see our show, you lucky kid, I hope you pay attention, yeah. Um, idea, pay attention to this. Give him a chance that the theater manager will cheat you out of your money. <laughs> Alright. So, I might, okay, I already talked to you. Well, let's just use the $10,000 on you. Okay, nothing. Alright, here we go. Time to get to the show. And everybody left. Yeah, that's right. Tonight, you got the Chaos Theater's Soul Men coming at ya. Rockin' and rollin' live on this here stage for a limited time only. The world's greatest bluesmen, the Runaway Five, and here they come. Oh yeah, baby! Yeah, again, I'm pretty sure this music is copyrighted. Um... I can barely hear it though, so I'm just gonna... Turned up again on my end. Oh yeah, that's much better. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's a good song though, I will give it that. Very uh, energetic, I suppose. Very fitting of uh, Mario on the left and Luigi on the right. <laughs> oh yeah, again, nobody is here. Everybody left. <laughs> All just because nobody wanted to see Luigi and Mario do their jazz performance. <laughs> oh, yeah. Gotta fix my sock here. Hold on here. Ah, da, 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 da. There we go, that's much better. Oh, and everybody's back. I don't care what they have to say. Because they just spawn out of nothing. Oh, pardon me. Yeah, that's what I thought. 
and through here we go. Really fun? Okay. Okay, okay. Yeah, click the wrong button. Activate the wand of mill. Excuse me, what's that you got there? Let me take a real close look. As it is, we just have to go back around here. Yipes, you surprised me. Now I'm not sure what to do. I got the money, of course, and now the Runaway 5 are free to leave. Got no complaints, uh, now that I have my money. Well, what do you know? This little nipper took us from a nightmare to a dream. Ah, oh, this means we can get out of this dump. I'm a good driver. Come on, I'll show you. Alright, let's move on to the next town. I'm sure our old hunk of junk. Uh, old. Wow, I really stuttered on that one. Old hunk of junk will get us there. Uh, I didn't make a spectacle of myself, did I? You know, nobody knows your name. So, no. Okay, cool. Anything. Alright, if I ever free to leave, yeah. Okay. okay. Anyways, now that we've done that, guys. I'm sure they'll just give this miner a ride to the movie theater. <laughs> our ride's the next down. Here we go. Let's go to three. To our tour boss, our tour, our tour boss, uh, is too loud for any ghost to bother us. Do you want to ride? Yes. Oh yeah. Let's go. Get on the bus. Well, let's get on the bus, guys. Hooray! Party time. Okay, guys. Here we go. And like that, they were never seen again. Hey, sidewalk, get out of my way. <laughs> Oh yeah. Off we go to 3D. Yeah. Yeah. Off we go past the orange man and the apple man as well as we drive off into the sunset. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's an item there. Well, well now I'm sad though. Because I didn't know that was there. Anyways. Off we go through the ghost tunnel. Where they won't even bother us. Because apparently we're too loud. Yeah. Yeah. There are no ghosts whatsoever. That, And we also ran, the, ran two stop signs. Alright, cool. Looks like we have to say goodbye for now. This town seems pretty gloomy, but I'm sure you can light up the place with your own little veranda sunshine. Hope to see you again sometime. Look for us to be seeing at some theater in Forside. Oh, thank you for just ditching us here, but alright. Cool. Alright. Let's do some map looking I guess. We have food, hospital, shop, hotel, to Tucson and to desert. Alright. Good to always see I suppose. Oh, let's go in here. Who's in this house? No one is here now. Okay. Clearly not as there's just people yelling at people. Hey, let's go to the, the circus, guys. There's bound to be something going on at the circus. Hello. Nope. How can we defeat the zombies? Oh, uh, I just don't know. Zombies are slowly advancing towards the tent. Everyone, I repeat, the zombies are on the move, yeah. I'm glad you're going to help us, but you're pretty young. Yeah. Why don't we get all the zombies in this tent and then set it on fire? Now I'll get much before we have a chance to do anything, yeah. This room is very special, guys. Uh, and I'm going to do an entire video, not a stream though. Uh, an entire video on my YouTube channel. Directly related to this room here. I'll explain it a bit later. Uh, Y'all just have to take my word on that for now, that this room, or that room, is very special. Very, very special and can do some crazy things.
guy stuck around in the trash can. Well, let's see here. There's a skip sandwich inside. Yeah. Free stuff in the trash. Yeah. What do you have to say, lady? That's right. There was a rumor that a monster called uh, Belch is screwing up the town. Belch. That's a gross, twisted name, even for a monster. Yeah. Indeed, it is. Um, so yeah. Just kinda looking around a bit here. I'm looking for anything in particular other than like a, a fight, I guess. I don't know. I'm a wimpy little guy, so I can't open the door. You know, it's 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 scary. Oh, there's an enemy here. Guys, let's beat it up. Now let's you're awfully kind talking, taking uh, time out to talk to a mouse. This mouse loves you, are it? Well, please don't. Hey, a zombie. I'm watching a zombie movie. Can you come by later? All right. We'll do then. <laughs> Around here, all right. Oh yeah. What is? Oh, these are enemies, though. Just these. Kind of the smiling Sam and the. Handsome Tom. Okay. I'm just gonna use a PSI games there. Defense down, Alpha. Cool, cool. Don't really like that, but alright. Just gonna. Smash for 103 HP. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, the enemies here are pretty crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ooh, some trash. Let's see here. There's a teddy bear inside. Paula takes it. Alright. Welcome back, Teddy uh, Teddy Bear, to the party. We're not going to talk to that guy. Because he needs money. And we don't have that kind of money. Yeah. Uh, what's... Uh, hold on. What's up here? As we walk alongside here. Cool, there's a grave. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Photography Man. Picture is taken instantaneously in front of a random grave site. I'm a photographic genius, but if I do say so myself, uh, make sure to say, uh, okay, get ready for an instant memory. With the camera ready, say, a post-mortem. <laughs> a post-mortem. <laughs> ah, yeah, that's terrible. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. Yeah, remember that time you said post-mortem? Yeah, there was something special there, though. Alright, cool, what do we have here? So we have a... Zombie... Possessor and an urban zombie. Okay. Oh, cool. Summon more of themselves that they can just die. Okay. Feel free to call for help, but it won't help you. Okay, there are... These guys are very strong. Oh cool, I got possessed by a mini ghost. As we get him with the PSI games beta. Yeah, return to the Earth as... That was by far the weakest of things. Yeah, Teddy Bear is kind of OP. Okay, just die. Yeah, melted into thin air. Yeah. I don't 
quite remember what that thing does. It's just like an extra immortal enemy. <laughs> Let me guess, does uh does like say a healing beta get rid of it? Okay, it doesn't. So now that we've tested that, we know for certain that healing beta does not work. And that is, uh, fairly useful information, alright. Um, so let's head to the hotel, I guess. Which was right down there, cool. Oh, yeah. So, a suspicious woman talking with the zombies around here, alright. Ooh, that's a lag spike if I've ever seen one. All right, now let's go into the hotel. Go into the ATM room. Pull out a... $50. Under the Three Sunset Hotel, one night still will cost you... Okay. $120 are it. <sighs> yeah. Okay. So if it's one twenty we need seventy, okay. Whatever. Three yeah, okay, whatever. Have a nice day, yeah. Hopefully that gets rid of the, the ghost following me. Nope, still there. So, sir, are you going out? The guest newspapers that were delivered to the hotel today are different than normal. The paper is called the Zombie Herald, I'm scared, but let me tell you what's in it. Destroy the humans. Hold the town for our glory and for the glory of our master, yeah. Go into here. Be careful while walking around, um, around outside, especially near the graveyard, yeah. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure it'll be fine. Yeah. And you get another lag spike there. Yeah. Oh, uh, what do you have to say, mister? Shh, don't talk too loud. What do you want? Bye. Tell you're going to bomb a bottle rocket and a rust promoter. Yeah, no, it's not useful. Um, no. Yeah. Oh, what else do we have here? Butterfly. Don't enter. Well, game, why'd you make a don't enter sign if you don't intend for me to enter? Huh. Oh, those were enemies. Okay, alright. Gauge the no good fly and the putrid moldy man. Alright. Now it's just PSI Fire Alpha the front row. And with that. Take him out. Oh no, not the teddy bear, no, we need that for something. Oh yeah. PSI Games Alpha, just take them out. Heck yeah. Alrighty, not bad, not bad. Um... Hmm, yeah. Strange, but alright. Um, okay. Um, I'm not going through there. 
Because there's enemies and I'm not dealing with them. Um, okay. Let's just bob and weave our way through here. That's a mouse again. Oh, yeah. I okay, guess so that's just nothing then. Um, okay then. Did we... No, I don't think we have tried going through here now. Ever the zombies whisper, Master Belch will give us our lives back. Master Belch is the zombie leader. He must be really pukey, yeah. But, like, where is Mr. Bell or Master Belch, rather? Some of ghosts are on the... As, uh, I can't get to uh, two center four side. Maybe the hidden road in the graveyard is safe, yeah. Nope. Oh. Oh. Front the... Trick or treat, or trick or trick or trick kid. All right. Okay. Let's just take this thing out. Just take out the trick or trick kid, and now let's just beat up. What was it? Handsome Tom? And like that, taken out. Oh, ooh, level 18. Not bad. Um, yeah. What do I have to say? I saw a beat up tour bus going to Farside. We can't go through the tunnel. The band was really noisy, so the ghost didn't approach the bus. It's great to be so happy-go-lucky, huh? Yeah. It really is, when you think about it. Um, yeah. Oh, there is a butterfly. Yeah. Another trash can. Oh, just plain old garbage, alright, that's sad. Oh, is that a zombie dog? Yo! We've beaten up living dogs, but this one's a real zombie dog, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's take it out. <sighs> oh. Stop this immediately. Stop. Okay. Mm hmm. So, lesson learned. Don't, don't fight the zombie dogs. Urgh, yeah. This is where they keep the... Do they not have an ATM in the hospital? I don't think they have an ATM in the hospital. Also, quick question, do you do that for free? They want to see Paula. This is very nice, still in Congress, please wait 120. It's fine, Paula can just stay dead for a while. We don't need Paula anyways, yeah. Okay, the snake's afraid of me. Cool. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, there was a shop right there. Okay, whatever. I know why we're losing, because we haven't bought anything. Duh. The reason that we're always dying is because we haven't uh, spent enough on capitalism. <laughs> Remember, kids, if you have uh, troubles, don't worry, just invest in capitalism. It'll never fail. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's gonna take 2,000. Buy, what do you have? Buy, love, same refreshing room, toothbrush. Okay. Where how may I help you? 
Uh, minor league bat. Okay, so I guess I'll throw it on Paula. Okay, that's absolute garbage then. Um, so let's just Okay. So now we just throw the Iron League Bat to Geist. Okay. It's... Okay. So both of these are upgrades, and then it doesn't really... Alright, okay, so let's sell... For Paula's, let's sell the Sandlot Bat. Ah, uh, yeah. Ah, uh, yes. For the, uh, because we do need a thick fry pan as well. Uh, we'll have Paula carry it. Yeah, 30 to 42. Uh, yes. And then that'll be it. Now, so let's just equip the minor league bat for a 71 offense. Um, okay, cool. Now let's walk all the way across the street, because the hospital does not have an ATM for some reason. Uh, let's just revive Paula, but first, can you do anything? I mean, I believe it, I'm a healer. If you have someone else that can be treated at the hospital, it's my job to cure you. Do you need some help? Yes. Purify and you charge your seven dollars. We need healing geist. There, you're already healed. Can I do my job well or what? Yeah. Let me see, I don't have a person like you. Ah, okay. I have a person like that in our hospital. Okay. Paula, Palms is burning and is still unconscious. Please spend your twenty dollars for the doctor's fee. Yeah, whatever, whatever. So that you recovered, Paula. Come back anytime you need, yeah. Whatever. Oh uh, yeah. Okay, I guess let's just go around looking for that uh secret passageway, I guess. The course of the zombie relief corps is in the circus tent at the center of town. We want to crush the zombies, but I think they'll crush us, yeah. I've certainly heard my fair share of zombies crushing us or whatever. But we'll be fine. <laughs> oh yeah. We have to go up a bit more. Because I'm pretty sure that like the photo man showing up was like a clue or whatever. Um, yeah. So off we go. No problem here, it's just right here. No, this is the spot. Okay. Um, alrighty, alrighty. What's this here? Hint shop realization. Okay, what do you have for me, Hitman? I still have my money on me. Wait a minute, I'm start to give you a great hint for just $60. Okay, take it. There's a tunnel northwest of this town. There are two guard zombies that hang out at the entrance. They're actually pretty nice guys. Might be a good idea to meet those guys. But it's quite alright if you don't, though I think that you really ought to go there. That's it for today. Okay, thank you, Hitman. Hint man, not Hitman. Oh, that's a completely different service. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Let me take a drink here. Oh, yeah. Whew, yeah. Yeah. Let's go to the hotel here. Drop off our garbage. Uh... And by garbage, I mean just all of our money. There we go. Cool, cool, cool. Um, alright then. Not bad, not bad. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna stream for too much longer. Probably gonna get to that, uh, not gonna fight those guys. Probably gonna get to that, uh, before-mentioned, uh, gate, probably. 
Uh, and I think we'll call that the uh, end of the stream, I think, once we get there. Oh, eventually. So it's not right there, okay. Hmm. It said northwest. Hmm. Do they mean northeast? Wait, no, I'm on east. That northwest is the other side. Okay, I'm very tired. <laughs> Very, very tired, yeah. Hopefully we don't have to fight the ghosts there. That's an enemy, not an item. Well, let's see here, there's an, in an insect eyed spray inside. Okay, cool. Cool, I guess, I don't know. That's just housing, those are all enemies. That's just more enemies. Let's just Oh, thank goodness this is just a normal attack. Alright, here we go. Oh, let's just beta them all. Ooh, 70, alright, not bad. Lowering my guts, how dare you? Get baited. Baited, that is a totally real thing that people probably say, oh, actually Geist is real low <laughs> on life. Actually quite quite a bit low, yeah. We'll have to use a, uh... Yeah, we'll just pop a, uh... Life up beta on Geist real quick to get him nice and healthy, yeah. Where is... Okay, we'll just fight two of these guys then. A putrid mug man and a sm er, yes, a putrid mug man from the Cuphead games, ladies and gentlemen. There he is. We got him. And a smelly ghost. All right. Uh, so let's just hit him, and then we'll have you do fire, I guess. Yeah, take him out. Yeah. We'll just continually beat him up. Oh, cool, now Paula is crying, I guess. That's cool. Hopefully that ends after the battle. Paula, are you still crying? No, you're not. Oh, that is garbage. It's just the one... <laughs> it's just the one fly. That no good fly, just... just more like, get out of here, fly. <laughs> oh, yeah, ooh, level 26, yeah. <laughs> he stares into your soul. He looks you over. He looks you over. He steals into your soul. Hmm. Ah, uh, please don't tell me I need an item. Use. Okay. Well, at least we know where they are, so that's cool. Oh, of course. <laughs> oh, whatever. Oh, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Yeah. At least we got that, though. Uh, so let's... I don't even know what we're supposed to do, and of course everyone joins in this fight. Okay. 
idea. We just hit him with PSI Games Beta. Paul just does a bash on the putrid, uh, or just does nothing. Games Beta, activate! Okay, cool. Now, Paula is somehow attacking through the tears with a critical hit. Oh, it saved us quite a bit of time. Yeah. No. Get out of here. I will destroy you, fly. Get taken out. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Not bad time, though. And I don't really know what we're supposed to do, per se. I guess we go and, um... That was... interesting, I guess. Anyways. Maybe through here. I'm just here now. Okay, whatever. And here! Yeah, I worked for the zombies, but I betrayed them too. I'm a con man, so I know the score. Belch gives life to the zombies, but Belch works for Gygus, who I heard might be female. Well, I'm not really sure whether Gygus is a male or a female. I'm a helpful con man, don't you think? Sure. If you want to think that way, go on ahead. How can you smile like that in a dangerous place like this? I'm not. Anyways, um, I guess we go to the tent, I guess? What's in here? No problem. Okay. There's just nothing here, I guess. Oh, alright. Thank you, dog. You're truly the most useful of us all. Um... Okay. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, yeah, so I saw beat up. Okay, that's. I have already talked to you. Um, around this way and around that bend. Nope, been going here. Did you read more of the pun calendar? Did I miss that? I have not read. Uh. Any of it yet, I'm going to save that for, uh, uh, not this Sunday stream, but the one afterwards, which will, again, be Earthbound, probably. <laughs> that or I'll, I'll, I'll save it until next week. We'll say, we'll put it at that. Next week will be red for sure. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, still trying to find a... Alright, I've already been to you. Let's just head to the tent. Maybe there's something there. Hey, we found where the zomb- no. But yeah, we found where the zombies are. I think we passed the tent. Nope, not gonna deal with the flies. Is, is the tent? I don't think the tent is here. Nope, it's in the other side of town. Over here. In the middle. Like the game told me. <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright, now we just go through here, talk to them, maybe they have something. Okay, yeah. Wait, some, oh, uh, I, I just don't know. Okay. Okay. Alright. Again, I don't really know what to do here. I'm so scared of the zombies. I spent all of my time running from them. I can't even get home. Yeah. There's a rumor that there is an underground path at the edge of the graveyard that takes you somewhere. When you get through the path, you'll meet a dirty, stinky, ugly, powerful monster. But my paint's just thinking about it. Yeah. This town seems very dark, right? The, peop uh, the people are mostly living at the center of town. I wonder how we should get uh, the town back from the zombies, yeah. Take a look at that chick in front of the hotel. Regardless of some of the people I've seen or hanging out with, I think I'd like to spend some time with her. Oh. 
Oh, you're the solution this whole... I guess I should have just talked to that one guy. Okay, very odd music, but alright. I guess we just head in here, alright. Oh no! That lady just so happened to be the one from the, the last time. Oh no! <laughs> oh, oh, you're losing consciousness. What could be the fate of Geist and his friend? Again, my name is Steve and Paula is not my friend. I have been kidnapped, please help. Okay, just nothing. Alright, what items do we have? Alright, we got them all. The door is locked. What's happening? I'm calling out to you, who I have never met. I'm calling our friend, who we have never met. Jerry, Jerry. We need your help. I am Paula, and I am with another friend. Geist, who is totally not Steve. He is very much Geist, and definitely not Steve. Oh, we are trying to contact you. Winters, a small country to the north. So small that it might as well be Canada. <laughs> Snowwood, a Snowwood boarding house. I am Paula, and I am with another friend, Geist, who is totally not Steve. We are trying we are trying to contact you. If you hear me, please wake up and head south. Only you, though far away, can see us, Jerry. <laughs> please hear my call and begin heading south. Jerry, you are a friend who we've never met, but you are our one and only hope. What if I just stay in bed? Oh no, I had to get up. Alright. Ah, Jerry, I just dreamt that you and I were taking a walk. What's wrong? Nothing of particular worth. Alright, guys, before we get too sidetracked in the Jerry plot, in the in Jerry's uh, plot here, oh no. Jerry, where are you going in the middle of the night? Out the window. You know the dorm rules, right? If you get caught, you'll get pun uh, punished big time. What? What's wrong, Jerry? Alright, there must be some reason that I don't understand. I won't stop you. It's dangerous to leave without taking anything along. Hey, I think there's some stuff in the locker room that you should get. I'll help you get out of here. Thank you. Tony joined you. Hooray! <laughs> Alright, cool. Uh, cool, cool, cool. I'm going to, before we get uh, sidetracked here, I'm gonna save the game real quick. I don't think we're gonna call that a stream for the night, I think. I right, hold on, let me... There we go, nice and saved. Alrighty then, guys. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, that'll be the end of the stream here. Uh, next time around, we'll uh, finish off Jerry's story, hopefully, and save Geist and Paula. Uh, but for now, that'll be the end of the stream. Subscribe on YouTube, follow me on Twitch, and uh, do whatever do whatever makes the algorithms good, I guess. I don't know. Anyways, I hope you had a good night.